Welcome to Joyriders Key Worker Commuter Route, funded by Waltham Forest Connecting Communities. Today, stepping out beyond Waltham Forest for the first time, High Street Kensington to Stratford Railway Station via Bayswater, Hyde Park, Grosvenor Square, Trafalgar Square, The Strand, Fleet Street, St Paul's in the City, Mile End and Bow, 17.9 kilometres. The Relive video shows the journey from Stratford and return. Follow Joyriders on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter or Eventbrite to stay up to date with all our route advisories and cycle training videos. Start out, head east along High Street Kensington, turning into the cycle path through Kensington Gardens to Bayswater Road. Observe my positioning as I pass the truck. I can see his mirrors, therefore he can see me. Coming up to a left turn lane here, very dangerous if you get caught in one of these when you want to go straight ahead, so make sure you merge into the go ahead lane in good time. Lovely stretch through Hyde Park. crossing Park Lane at the lights and into Mayfair. Make sure you ride in primary position, a car door and a little bit more away from any parked vehicles. You don't want to get doored. Coming into Grosvenor Square, be aware that traffic may merge with you from the right. When facing a give way sign, you must give way to everyone, vehicles and people, on the priority road. Cutting down, I take New Bond Street through to Piccadilly, where I turn left and take primary position. There is no way to filter here, so just wait until the traffic starts to move. Hold primary all the way through the intersection, around onto Haymarket. This ensures no one can pass me, because it is unsafe to do so. I've indulged myself by hanging a Yui on Trafalgar Square, taking in the sights. Then cross by St Martin in the field and down the Strand. Always move into primary position in plenty of time to pass buses or other vehicles.
I filter to the front through the traffic queue, then around Aldwych. Cross over the lanes of traffic onto the city lane. Make sure you're in primary here, observing and communicating constantly. then turning left into Fleet Street. All the way along, then up Ludgate Hill and round to the right of St Paul's. Please don't be the cyclist that shoots the red light. Through Bank Intersection, much more pleasant with only you and the buses, then down Leadenhall and by Aldgate. Note, here I do something I rarely do, pass on the inside of a bus. I know the light sequence here, there is no left turn available, and I'm comfortable with the decision. Then we're on to Cycle Superhighway 2. We'll follow this all the way to Stratford, through Whitechapel, past the Royal London Hospital, Mile End, Bow, and into Stratford. The biggest thing to be aware of when using a segregated cycle lane is that you are riding in a place where drivers are not looking. This means you have to be particularly observant of every side road and driveway. Vehicles can come at you from three different directions and none of them are looking for you. In all cases, you have the right of way, so take it. If you touch your brakes, drivers take it to mean you will let them go. So be ready, but not submissive. Make sure they see you, sit up straight, point at them, yell. Confidence and assertiveness are the way to go. Here, as everywhere, there is no obligation for cyclists to use cycling infrastructure. Make your own call. Then, before you know it, here we are at Stratford. Hope you enjoyed the ride. See you next time.